and I'm standing there and I'm watching that wood. It's like I'm uh, waiting something, or not someone, but something. Okay, I'm just observing. Can you tell me what era you think this is from? Uh, 76? 17, 17, 16, did you say? 76. 76. Are you on, yes. are you on Earth? Is it planet Earth you are on? Yes. I'm on Earth, yes. Wonderful. Well, but it it feels strange. Uh, I'm not seeing anyone here. Um, I don't know what I'm waiting for. Probably to hunt an animal. Yes, I don't know. Yes, makes sense. Yes. Uh, Wonderful. Sounds like an amazing experience. Have you got a name in this place? Ari. Ari. A R I. Ari. Ari. Wonderful. That's fantastic. Well done. So you're on Earth. You're a man. You're a warrior. Mm hmm. In your 20s. Yes. No shoes. Yes. And a skirt. No. Wonderful. Only a skirt I have. I, I feel that I have only that skirt, probably made from leaves and from uh, animal uh, skin. Wonderful. It's a combination. But above, I don't have anything. Uh, is, it, is it warm where you are? I don't, I don't feel it is warm. Uh, no, it's peaceful here. Peaceful, yes. Yeah. Yes. Uh, I don't see anything. I see a uh, 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 path through the forest right in front of me. See, what was that again? I didn't see what? A path. Path. Oh. Mm hmm. Can you walk towards that? No, I'm just uh, observing it. Just, just I really that. don't. I I can't. I can't feel what am I doing here. But I don't feel like I am nervous. I'm very relaxed, actually. Wonderful. But I don't understand the. Uh, why am I standing still and I'm observing the surroundings? Probably I'm waiting for an animal. Yes, that's something. That makes sense, hunting. And yes. it have to be quiet when you're waiting an animal for hunting. Yes. So. Okay, that sounds like a wonderful this place. Is, yes, it is. It's a very peaceful place. Wonderful. Very abundant with the vegetation. The the trees are very tall. It's it's very nice here. Wonderful. So you do you have family there? I don't feel like. Just on your own, part of a tribe. Yes. Yes, I'm. I feel like I'm all alone. I don't have any tribe. I. I don't know what I'm I'm doing here alone. I know I am a warrior, but I'm here alone. I don't know why I am alone. Or probably I'm alone only in the woods, but not I don't know. Yeah, maybe. Right, that sounds like a really wonderful place. In a moment, Alina. I'm just gonna snap my fingers. And I'd like you to go, if you can, to the most important part of Ari's life.
Go there now. I'm with my tribe here. We are all uh, around the fire. It's uh, night. <clears throat> we all are standing like in meditation. Some of us we have. Um, I'm a, I'm an Indian. Oh wow! Yes. Fantastic. Are you a, a native a Indian from America? That type of Indian, or somewhere else? Oh. I see my people like having, and I feel like I have a um, very long hair. My people as well. So I could be in indigenous American Indians. Wow. Wonderful. How old are you at this most important point? Uh, around 40. 40. Yes. And what's your position in this tribe? Is there a hierarchy? Do you have... Yeah, I, I, I'm seeing um, the higher chief, if I can say so, um, the head of, of the tribe. Yes. He's an old man with a... Um, uh, 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 he's wearing uh, animal skin uh, like a big coat but it's not a coat it, it doesn't have a, a, it's like a cloak is it like a, a green ceremonies, rituals? Yes, yes, yes. It, it's a, it's a, white tiger. Wow. Fear, yes. Amazing. So what, what is the ritual? What are you doing? I don't feel it is a ritual, actually. Uh, we all gathered uh, around the fire with no reason, just for chatting, just for planning. I think we are planning. I feel that we have to go to a war. Oh. And we are planning the strategy. And who we are not a, a, a violent uh, tribe. We actually are very peaceful. But uh, uh, our enemy is not very peaceful, so we actually have to protect ourselves. Yeah. And I like our um, our uh, tribe head uh, chief. Uh, I don't know how it call it. Um, it's so wise, it's so, I don't know if you can see her, his face. It's so, it's like a, a grandfather, an old grandfather, so wise, so calm, so gentle, so, so everything. So, and um, in these plans, he doesn't want for us to harm anybody only if it's really really but really necessary so even they are our enemies but he doesn't want to, for us to, to hurt anybody wonderful so your enemies are they are they white people or fellow indians? no no in indians as well fellow indians yes Yes, are those with um, uh, with the paint on their faces, white paint with the um, with the shaved heads. Yes, well, and only only here on the top with the, well, some some hair. Yes, Mohican, feathers. Mohicans. 
Mm. That's what they are called. Wonderful. Wow. Functions. Now, in a moment, I'm going to snap my fingers and I'd like you to go just before you transition from this life. Go there now. How old are you? Fifty. I'm cold. Where are you? Forest alone and uh, um, I'm bleeding, I'm hurt, I'm wounded, and I'm alone. And it's cold, so cold. I'm trembling a lot. What caused the wound in you? Um, it was a fight here. They caught me unguarded, alone in the woods while I'm hunting. Uh, some animal. They trapped me here. And they leave me here. Was that a fellow Indian tribe? An enemy? Yes. From another tribe. From the other tribe. Yes. Mm. I was the most strongest from from my tribe the strongest warrior I, I was um, their enemy the fiercest enemy so they they wanted to 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 get rid of me. I understand. Okay. Well, now we've been here. I'm going to click my fingers. And I'd like you to transition to the other side of this life. Just look back at the life as Ari. As this fierce warrior. Do you know the reason you was taken to that life? What lessons you needed to learn? To learn that uh, you don't have to hurt anyone. You have to be wise, even if you have enemies. Try to not hurt him. Uh, try to not harm them. Try to try to be peaceful. I mean, uh, this is was my this was my lesson here. Uh, to be wise in everything I do, even. I was a warrior, doesn't mean that uh, I have to, to fight with everybody and to kill someone or something like this. Wonderful. Is there any parallels between that life and the one you're in presently?
Actually, it is. What's that? Because uh, all my life, um, I've tried not to hurt people. And um, I've tried to... to help them with through my words through my wisdom and uh, I I uh, didn't judge and I uh, forgot them I forgave them not forgot I forgave them so this was the connection that's amazing well done right in the weeks and hours what's going to follow you're going to notice a connection from this place and more knowledge may come back to you as the days weeks pass by Now, with this connection, I'd like you to send healing back to that life. Heal any wounds, settle any karmic debt. Send in love from your heart back to that life. Wonderful. That connection will always be there. The hours, the days, and the weeks that follow. Wonderful. Now, Melina, I'd like you to imagine in the distance an elevator. A wonderful crystal elevator. Just step towards the elevator because once you get inside you're going to go up and up and up through the dimensions higher and higher. You're going to go up and up you're going to get lighter and lighter. So just step through the elevator doors. Just notice a button that's got a glowing higher self on it. Press that button. See the doors closing on this beautiful crystal elevator. Feel yourself going up, higher and higher. Notice through the walls of the crystal elevator, all the different colors as you go higher and higher towards your higher self. See yourself getting faster and faster going through all the dimensions higher and higher towards your higher self. Feel your body getting lighter, the vibration getting faster, getting finer. Notice your body changing as it goes higher and higher towards the higher self. In a moment, we're going to get to the top. And the doors will open. And you may even be greeted by your higher self. When you are, greet your higher self. Take your time. And when 
you're finished greeting your higher self. Just say, I'm done. And I will know that you finished meeting and greeting your higher self. So as we go up higher and higher towards your higher self, feel yourself slowing down and the doors opening. Step forward and greet your higher self. Just say, I'm done. I'll be quiet for a moment. I'm here. Wonderful. Hello, Alan. Is this the higher self of Alina I'm talking to? Yes. Wonderful. That was quick. Yes, I have a very strong connection with her. You've been waiting. Oh, yes. Alina, she's got a few questions for you. Please she'd, do. She'd like to know why all her life she's felt disconnected from people. Because she was more connected with the higher realms. It was not easy. It, 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 was, it wasn't easy for her to feel connected with both realms and the 3D world and the higher realms. Just do you know why she's rejecting people? For no reason in a pleasant in a present life and like i told her as well because of her energy she had a contract with gaia and he through her energies had to pull out all the shadows from people and it this is actually not very comfortable for them. And they are going away. Because it is not easy for, for them to support these energies. Is, is there anything and she it, can do? And it's not easy for, for her either. Because it was very painful for her to, to see that People are going away from her, but this is, was her contract, and so she shouldn't worry about that. She should just relax. Just her contract is over. That contract is over now. Okay. So will people? Should she really stop regretting, um, rejecting people now? Then now the contract has ended, maybe. It's going to be better, but in time, slowly by slowly, she must heal herself first. This is the most important step. How does she do that? How does she do the healing? Through this, through this course, this would be the first step. Wonderful. So is that the reason that uh, you pushed Alina towards this course? Yes, this is the reason, yes. Because uh, through this course, she will meet a lot of people. And like this, she can enhance her trust in them and to allow them to come into into her heart again it's not going to be easy for her but it's gonna be fine 
what should she do in her life from now on? Should she just, should she become a therapist maybe, or is there anything else in her contracts? This is only the first step. The hypnotherapy is mostly for her healing and then for helping another people. She will heal herself by being helped actually from the people. Wonderful. Do you have any but, uh, sorry. This is not her main mission, but I can I can tell you what it is. Please, yes do. I can't tell you what it is. Oh you can't the mission. No. Okay, okay. That's wonderful. Uh, have, have you got any messages for Alina, how she can help the collective of people around her and in the world in general? When she be healed, she will help the collective with her wisdom, with her powers and with her energies but now is not the moment for this okay wonderful have you got any other messages for Alina while you're here to be patient to have faith in her to have faith in her destiny and it's enough and she will reach this destiny yes she will get to the destiny yes with patience wonderful is it okay if i ask a question while you're here of course could you describe what it's like to be in the presence of source god energy <laughs> Wonderful question. <laughs> and uh, I don't think I can put it in word, this sensation, this feeling, this... I will try, though. So it feels like... Oof. It is the most wonderful feeling you can ever imagine, you can never feel, you can, you can feel all the love, the purest, purest love, the wisdom, the happiness, the, you, I can't, uh, uh, you don't have the, the right words for describing. Yes, I, I understand. I understand. How it is. Do we all return back to source when we finished our journeys in these different realms, different dimensions, or do we come and go from source? It depends. This is depends because many of you, you will can create, recreate your universe, your own universe. Okay. So, uh, maybe you will learn from source how to create new universes, to create new planets and all this kind of, I mean, uh, it's not, uh, it's not so uh, easy to go, to return to source. Easy is not the right word, but uh, I can find another one right now. Yes, please. Um, And returning to the source is uh, is depending because um, if you want to return to the source, you will. But otherwise, you will evolve and evolve and evolve. Then you will be prepared to to create your own universe. So at some point, you all will be those gods yes. that you are speak here on earth. So. 
we will, will we become sources ourselves in it? No. no, no, the source is only one. Right, okay. But you will be someday a little God, <laughs> like you have here on earth. Yes. And you can create everything you want, but you have the chance now with everything is going on on earth and with earth to learn a lot of things and to know how to do and to, how to make things better and how to to protect your universe and so on wonderful that's amazing thank you so much you're welcome <laughs> so uh, no more messages for alina if you haven't um no, I don't have. Well, we're finished. We're done, are we? Yes, done. It's okay. You yeah. can finish now. <laughs>